Okay, well, you've got me and Lassie splashing. I was going to bring the Rode Go uh, microphone for this video, but I'm using the little attachment on the top. The Rode Go, the batteries, even when you turn it off, I have to say, they seem to run out quite quickly. I was only recording for uh, maximum of an hour in, in camp. And I started to uh, come down here for this video and they uh, conked out quickly. So hang on, I had to stay quite close to the camera, but that works well, to be honest. You've got Lassie, you've got me, what more could you want? Nice scenery in the background not a soul about. Okay. <clears throat> Let's address the elephant in the room. Watches. Let's have a history lesson, first of all. I set this channel up for the fun of it around about 2010, 2009, 2010. I was married at the time to, uh, to Sue, some of you remember, some of you know. She was uh, suffering from cancer at the time. She had a, a four, I say that again, a four kilogram sarcoma in her left leg. For the Americans, that's about eight pounds of cancerous tumor in the left leg. It was a mighty big lump massive like a like a rugby ball in the leg anyway <clears throat> anyway after a lot of uh, messing around they uh, they removed the lump there was a few uh, mishaps along the way and basically um, in 2009 um, they amputated the leg at the hip try and save her life and of course in 2010 you know she she died and it was around about that time that I had a very small garden pond with a few fish in it a few koi a few gold north a few other strange <laughs> uh, aquatic creatures in it and I just had this idea that I wanted to uh, make the pond a little bit bigger so I went on a few uh, koi forums, met a few dear friends on there, Peter Waddington, rest in peace Peter, um, Susie and uh, you know a few other people back then. And I basically set up the channel because I just wanted to share some pond, some pond videos with, with watery, pondy people so the, the the title you know the the the, the website youtube address is yoda quicksilver yoda because i love star wars and i think i'd use yoda on one of the koi forums quicksilver because it was one of the one of the names of one of my uh, big koi that i had back then long since passed now but it uh he got to about 18 inches, oh, <laughs> uh, something like that. So I basically set the channel up as just a way of, you know, sharing fishy, fishy videos <laughs> with fishy friends. <laughs> and a couple of fishy dogs. Um, Sue died, as I said, in 2010. And then in 2011, I started walking again around Cheddar and Dartmoor here, obviously, um, which was where, where I used to walk with her uh, pretty much all the time. And I got this idea that I wanted to camp. I put the idea to Sue uh, a few times, you know, about camping, but it was uh, 
she was happy enough to, to walk around here, but uh, the idea of camping never really appealed to her. So I never pushed it. And anyway, then the cancer came along and then that was, that was pretty much that anyway. Anyway, of course, then, as I said, I then still had this idea about camping. So I think Facebook and Twitter were, I'm not even sure, I don't, don't think I even joined Facebook at that time. I joined Twitter and I started thinking about how to, how I could, um, you know, get into camping. I was already friends with uh, Chris Townsend at the time. I'd known him at that point for about seven years or something like that. And and I think there were some uh, other names that at that time, I have to say, were quite influential. Colin Ibbotson, which I never hear anything of these days. I may have, may have come across Martin Rye back then. I'm not sure, Martin, if, if your name goes back quite that far but there were several names and people that were talking about MLD Helen who's now in Norway I think um, several people were using MLD trail stars and other things like that but it was really like in its infancy and taps and things like that but it was really like in its infancy I think MLD had literally been around at that time for I don't know, six months, a year? I don't think it was very long. And I think they were quite a small, uh, quite quite small back then. So I think it was quite small back then. And like I said, I got this idea that I wanted to start camping. And most people, when they start doing this type of thing, they, uh, you know, they go straight for a tent. And admittedly, my very first camp was a tent. I kind of bottled it a bit. Um, but I still like the idea, you know, even back then when I'd never camped in my life before, well apart from the Duke of Edinburgh, I did the Duke of Edinburgh when I was 16 or 17 years old and hated the experience. It was, uh, it was just awful. And the tent, it was just a horrible experience. I had blisters. It was just a, a nightmare. It was a nightmare. It put me off uh, for years. And then I got this idea that I wanted to try tarps and, and things like that. So, of course, in 2011, that's when I started buying MLD uh, products. <laughs> I just never, never looked back since then. So, obviously, I bought some tarps. I don't really know where this conversation is going. So, if you hang around, you hang around, do this with the hands. If you hang around, you hang around. If you um, if you disappear, you disappear. It's fine. Um, I kind of sort of sat here, but as you can see, I'm not. Really, whoa! <laughs> that could be. Uh, <laughs> could end up with. Yeah, it's not the. It's not the. It's not the. It's not the. <laughs> it's not the greatest of um, places to be sitting, but I wanted to sit somewhere. Where you, where you could get me and and Lassie, and this was quite a good. This was quite a good spot. Without the road go, I can't, I can't go too far away from this microphone. So that's basically how the, and uh, yeah. So, so I started um, buying MLD products in uh, 2011. I think I bought the Super Tap first. I bought the uh, Trail Star. I bought some inners, um, probably a rucksack or... <laughs> um, I probably bought some inners and things like that. So obviously after Sue died, we'd been married for four years. I'd known her for six years before that. So we've been together for you know a good 10 years. Um, and unfortunately, four of those years, most of our marriage, we were dealing with this cancer, unfortunately. Um, so, I started, uh, I started walking around Cheddar again. 
and obviously because I went there every week with Sue for oh, seven plus years okay maybe it was a bit less because obviously in the last year or two she couldn't she couldn't go around um, but you know I mean I, I went around there regularly for six odd years every week and once a month we would come here so I got into the MLD products and then I would take the tarps with me um, to cheddar and if you go back to the very very beginning you'll see my early videos they're in a playlist and basically what I did was I pitched the tap with the phone I may have even said this in another video and basically just filmed the tap I didn't film myself I was far too shy to stand in front of the camera back then and basically I just you know filmed the tap with the um, phone not the camera with the phone and what would happen at the very beginning of the walk the first part of the walk around Cheddar would be like really 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 sad for obvious reasons I'd then stop pitch the tap have a cup of tea have fun doing that take a video of it and I usually make myself laugh in the video um, anyway I'm sure I've got that blocking thing on my phone anyway so I would then take a video on my phone and pack away the tarp, carry on walking around Cheddar. And as I was walking around Cheddar, I would be looking, not the whole time obviously, but I'd be watching what I just filmed and it would just crack me up. It was just so funny. I was doing the most ridiculously stupid things and it was just funny, it made, it made me laugh, and that was the most important thing for me. Laughter. If you can't have a laugh in this life, <laughs> then don't bother doing anything. And then of course in 2012, I, uh, I went out for my first camp, filmed it on the um, phone again, so the, the, I suppose where I'm heading with this is that the channel has always been set up for my, <laughs> for my benefit. Uh, obviously, a lot of you get a lot of joy and um, positivity and benefit out of it too. <laughs> but <laughs> I'm being very mean and everything like that. But the channel has always been for me and if other people can enjoy it along the way perfect brilliant that that's good um, but if there's anything that I do you know that people don't enjoy well that's not my problem I'm here to entertain myself I'm here to entertain people who want to be entertained by someone who doesn't give a flying blah, 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 about anything just generally I mean that's maybe why the channel hasn't really taken off uh, vision um, I'm not quite sure if you're the rest of your <laughs> vision as <laughs> it's not that I know um, I think you made a couple of suggestions I tried to find that comment um, I think you posted it on one of my um, videos about how to like you know improve um, views and things like that that was quite uh, interesting i'm increasingly doing like different thumbnails and things like that because yes i would like to increase views and things like that yes i would like to increase the subscribers they're going up slowly they, they creep up like <laughs> one one or two a week or something um like that and yes there are a lot of other channels that are much much more successful probably talking about rolex watches you know in a camping channel you know may harm the channel slightly i don't think it's going to make that much difference like i said i've been doing this for eight years and i've still only got three three point four thousand subscribers they just they sort of slowly 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 creep up <laughs> very creepy um I, and of course I tend to come back to the same place so 
so basically probably a lot of people do just disappear because they probably get bored with my nonsense and um, a lot of what I do is probably quite repetitive whereas you know, a lot of other people they probably go to different places and things like that so there's certainly something I'll look into at some point <laughs> whenever that some point is but frankly, I'm more than happy coming here, doing my own thing, whether it's uh, camping videos or blasty videos or watches occasionally. And, you know, on the whole, I think most of you understand and accept that. It's just as a few miserable so-and-sos who clearly don't like watches. They're either jealous or they just don't want a camping channel doing watches uh, you know it is what it is you know like I said I set the channel up for my own benefit and it's always going to be that way but you know I'm always going to try and do what I can to make it interesting for you the viewer who you know who wants to be interested and and follow along so yes it is my channel yes I have done it for myself and I will continue to do that but obviously I take into consideration an account of you know people um, watching as well um, but <laughs> but not that much that I'm going to stop talking about Rolex watches this is a Rolex Yacht Master on a blue blue shark NATO strap and if you want to thumbs down this video, carry on. <laughs> Which one buggers? Um, and that's basically, uh, you know, that's basically where we are. I just wanted just to say a few words about how the channel was set up. In a nutshell, it was set up for me. It's my own like little therapy thing, you know, to come out here, do my own thing, keep myself happy and cheerful keep everybody else who's interested happy and cheerful and I think plenty of you have a good a good laugh along the way therefore I think we've done you know we've done a good job in in that therefore we've done a good job in you know in that regard and you know I apologize if people don't like watches but you know what have I got to apologize for nothing <laughs> Uh, if anyone has any comments, suggestions or anything like that, down below. And if you want to dislike the video, carry on. Karma is just around the corner waiting for you. Uh, good luck. Good luck to my friend Richard, who's also struggling with cancer at the moment. I know he watches this channel. I've actually lost two friends already on Facebook from that um, wretched thing. So, you know, let's all stay healthy, cheerful, happy, cut out the misery, cut out the dislikes, there's just no need for it. L life is just too happy, you know, let's enjoy our lives, eh? Let's, let, you know, let, and that's what we're here for. We're here to be happy, to enjoy ourselves, to have a laugh. And not be miserable people. <laughs> I don't want to swear because I don't want the don't want my channel to be demonetized. <laughs> Otherwise, I call you miserable. Fa -fa 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 -fa. No, I mean to be honest, that's that's not me anyway. I'm not a sweary. I'm not a sweary person. I mean, I've never disliked a video in my life. If I don't, if I don't like a video, I just oh, I don't like that. I, mean, I go on to next one that person has made, or I just find a different channel or something like that personally I've never ever once disliked a video so I don't really know what people get out of disliking a, a video but anyway you know if it makes you happy if it makes you happy you know carry on disliking something if that's <laughs> if that's your lot in life good luck to you and I hope that the people who do dislike the watch videos I'll have a bit of a rant now <laughs> I hope that the people who do, you know, just like the watch chat, the, the watch videos, I, I hope that you're not so much the people who comment nicely on the other 
um, videos I think that would be a little bit of a shame because I think we've got some really nice people out there that make really really nice comments and I think if if you are someone who makes nice comments on other videos and then goes and dislikes one video you don't like I think on this channel I think we're I think we're above that I really do you know clearly this is just a fun channel where I just enjoy myself and and really 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 people who follow me and follow this channel especially for a while come on guys you should understand that by now you know really truly you should understand that this is just a channel for having fun not being serious and not being miserable okay you know this is a channel for being happy on and enjoying yourselves and like I said if you don't like part of it then just move on to the next thing I understand I understand the watches are freaking expensive you know and I'm not doing it to show off it might say it might maybe to some of you it looks like oh he's showing off he's got I'm not doing it for that I'm doing it because I enjoy the watches I enjoy messing around switching straps on them most people when they buy these things they keep them on the original bracelets you know I like to personalize them you know I get fun and enjoyment out of them I'm on lots of watch groups I enjoy sharing photographs and from that you know I enjoy making videos you know they don't get a well actually I said they don't get a huge number of views on the whole they actually get equally as many if not more views than the my camping videos or well, the last one I made hasn't so far but it, it's a slow accumulative um, thing it's the only one I did on rubber B <laughs> on your rubbers um, that is consistently over the last year or eight months anyway since I did it being my highest ranked um, it's got like over 6,000 views on it or something like that although on that one it's got quite a few dislikes because some people are just miserable I suppose or maybe I waffle on too long or I think I say which one I prefer at the very beginning so people turn off quite quickly like I said you know I'm not very good at this YouTubing business I just do it my own way and and if it works it works and you know if it <laughs> if it doesn't it doesn't you know I'm just here to enjoy myself and like I said if other people can get some benefit of it along the way then then that's a, jo a good job then that's a good job um, done and like I said it gets me out gets me enjoying some fresh air and countryside it uses up a good amount of time when I'm out making these videos which is nice so I'm not out here bored or sad or crying or anything like that you know <clears throat> There's a lot of, unfortunately, with this virus business, there's, uh, and there was before, of course, there's a lot of depression and anxiety and, you know, and mental awareness and mental health and all that type of thing. Um, I don't really suffer from any of that. I know quite a few YouTubers seem to, and I think they're, they're talking about it a lot. So, you know, good luck to them. Maybe I do suffer from something because I'm quite happy coming back to, to the same place, whereas I'm not so um, brave enough to go to, to new places so much. It's just, uh, I'm sure there's some psychological mumbo jumbo in there somewhere. Uh, but you know, a lot of people, they, you know, they do suffer from mental, from mental health and obviously they come out here and, and they and they make their videos and everything like that to you know keep themselves going and keep their viewers going and everything like that so I really do think that in this day and age you know we really should be above being miserable devils really do you know we're here on this earth to enjoy ourselves once and that's it once we're dead we're dead and you know we're not coming back <laughs> unless you believe in the afterlife or something like that god alone knows what i was before <laughs> god knows what i'll come back what i'll come back as anyway i just wanted to say that i thought this video would only be like a few minutes and it's turned out to be quite long uh but thank you to the people who do watch thank you to the people who do enjoy 
Thank you to the subscribers. I'm pretty much hitting 3,400 Lassie subscribers. Um, so, you know, I think the numbers will steadily increase. But like I said, it's not a channel for numbers. You know, as I said, yes, it would be nice to have more. It would be nice to have more views and more subscribers, but you know, that's not what this channel is about, you know. Maybe we'll get there one day. Maybe we'll have as many as Paul Nett Messner. <laughs> 100,000 subscribers. Jesus. Imagine 100,000 people following me. My God. <laughs> We'd have a lot of nutters running, <laughs> running around the world. Thanks to my friends in, uh, in England. 25% of you come from England. And about 25% of you come from America. You know, I've got a really good 50-50 um, or 25-25, if you look at it that way, split between... Um, come here, Lassie. Come right here. Between, um, between America and... Probably because I use all of the... No, stay there. <laughs> you know, don't you dare shake. Good girl, stay there. Um, so I've got a very good fairly even split between um, the United Kingdom and the US and then everywhere else is I've seen Japan no 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 I've seen Japan um, Indonesia Australia New Zealand Germany um, all sorts all sorts of different countries I'm sure there are other yeah I mentioned New Zealand I think obviously um, and I think there are other countries um, <laughs> as well enough who are mad enough to uh, to watch this 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 madman down in uh, <laughs> camping in the middle of uh, camping in the middle of nowhere, waffling on for ages and ages. So, oh, you are wet and cold. No, don't come near me. Don't come near. I'm not having you. Is soaking wet. <laughs> Thank you, and I will catch you soon. <laughs> That's enough of me. No, don't, don't shake all over the lens, either. All right, go on then, back in the water then. Go on then, have one more swim, and then we've got to get going. Time for a tea. Time for a tea and a pee. <laughs> all right. We'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching. <laughs>